the ancestors of Mr. Bhutto were responsible for terrorism in Kashmir, were responsible for terrorism in Punjab, were responsible for terrorism in Afghanistan, Baluchistan and Karachi. So one knows who the butchers are. The incubator of terrorism in the world has been Pakistan. The foreign minister of Pakistan is indicative of not just a bankrupt nation that is Pakistan. The statement by the foreign minister of Pakistan is indicative of not just a bankrupt nation that is Pakistan, but bankruptcy of emotions and bankruptcy of intellect by the leaders who run that country. If a foreign minister of a country is making such statements, I think it doesn't hold him well or in good stead because this is the country which was involved in grey lists in FATF by multiple times and he probably doesn't know that. Also you must remember that the country he represents has been incubating terrorism unlike the incubation which India is leading and working with the incubator of terrorism in the world has been Pakistan so far as leadership of Prime Minister Modi is concerned the world has recognized that leadership and the world has seen what kind of leader Prime Minister Modi is who has not only helped India but has helped rest of the countries even during COVID including Pakistan we must understand that the ancestors of Mr. Bhutto were responsible, were responsible for terrorism in Kashmir, were responsible for terrorism in Punjab, were responsible for terrorism in Afghanistan, Baluchistan and Karachi. So one knows who the butchers are. So far as India is concerned, India is a law-abiding nation where the constitution works and Mr. Modi has been given a clean chit by none less than the Supreme Court of this country. I think it holds Mr. Bhutto in a good stead that he should start recounting the acts of terrorism in his own country where the agencies and his own ancestry has created terrorism and the networks of terrorists across the country and is responsible for the terrorism which they are facing. Whether it's Tariq or others, they are constantly at war with each other. We know that the kind of work which is going on in the country of Pakistan, as well as the kind of representation which Pakistan has made. It is not just, it is not just the desperate act of a desperate nation or a foreign minister who is likely to be representing a failed state in a very short time.